Yer, what is good, John? Welcome back to yet again another episode of JI Productions. It's your boy JI, and I'm back at it again with another banger video for you guys, man. As you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail of today's video, we do have a unboxing for Vader, another modification, bro. And y'all can tell by the title and the thumbnail, we do have a new set of wheels. A new look for Vader. I'm gonna go ahead and flip Vader around because we are gonna be test fitting the wheels in today's video as well. I just wanna make sure that they clear the OEM Brembo 1LE brakes. Y'all already know I got the six pistons up front and the four pistons in the rear. So that being said, I wanna make sure that everything is good, everything is straight, and we don't have any clearance issues. So let's go ahead and move the car first and then we'll get straight into the unboxing. I did pump some E85 in the car to see if the issue was fixed. If you guys have been in the loop with all the vlogs, y'all would have known I took the car out and went to go get some data logs for RK because the car has been acting real funny lately. And I thought that it fixed itself and it definitely did not. Um, I pumped some E85 in the car. Chill, no cap. I put some E85 in the car and now we're back to running mad rich on watt pools. So that being said, we for sure still have an issue. But it's all good, man. I just got a email from Summit. My spark plugs should be here today. And I mean, not today, but tomorrow. It should be here tomorrow and then also the tool to do the install is also coming tomorrow. So hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we get everything tomorrow. I can swap the plugs out and then we can go take the car out, test it and make sure everything's good. Hit my boy RK up and go from there. All right, you guys, so as y'all can see, we got Vader parked straight ahead. And as y'all can see by the box, y'all can already see the name on the box, bro. <sighs> y'all probably are already guessing, you feel me? You probably already guessing, you probably are. And you might be right, and you might be wrong. Whew. Bro, I've been needing these. When I say needing, I mean shout out for it, Star. Y'all already know how they get with the sticker. When I say needing, bro, oh my God. When I say needing, I have been needing these joints, bro. Oh my God. I already know. Yeah. Oh my god, shit ton of bugs in the garage. Anyway, I've been needing these, bro. All right, all right. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna tease y'all no more. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all, bro. <laughs> oh my god. Bro, so yes, the cat is out of the bag. <laughs> or should I say, the wheel is out of the bag, bro. Yes, Vader finally has a set of front runners to go with the OG Weld Rear Drag Pack. Woo! Oh my God. I have been waiting for a set of front runners for Vader for the longest time. Like I told y'all on today's video, we are actually gonna be mounting these up to the car to see how they look. But y'all tell me in the comments, man. Whoo! So for those of you guys that are wondering the specs and all of that, I will get into that. Here we go. So yeah, they are 18 by five, 18 inch diameter. 
in five inch width. As y'all can see, this joint is extremely light. It weighs literally little to nothing. And it is going to help Vader make that low quarter mile pass that we've been chasing for a fat minute. I've actually got something planned for these right here. Vader's about to go through a whole makeover. So let's go ahead, jack the car up, get this wheel off, and get that wheel on, man. Sheesh. Bro, I'm so hype. Oh, I'm so hyped. And, and, check me out. No side skirts right now. So jacking up Vader is about to be a breeze. What? No side skirts? Man, if you got a 6 gen and you got the ZL1 style side skirts, you already know what I'm talking about, bro. Alright, y'all. All right, y'all, this is the moment of truth. Will they fit? I'm pretty sure, but you never know, bro. With my luck, you never know. That's so hard, bro. What? So now, like, when you at, like, this angle, are you seeing it? Yo, yo, I almost want to turn the wheel. Make sure that we clear. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's touching at all. Yeah, we're clear, bro. Yup, we're clear, bro. I gotta grab a flick. I gotta hurry up and grab a flick. <laughs> oh Lord, talk to that boy. Oh my gosh. What? Cut the flash on. <laughs> that being said, man, the wheels out of the box. We went with the four stars up front. I went with the five spoke joint because it's similar to the S71s from Weld. And I don't really like the Mitch match wheel look, bro. I like everything to look uniform. So that's why I went with these joints. But as y'all see, man, they look mighty good with that brushed aluminum lip. Sheesh, man. When I tell y'all these wheels are hitting, these wheels are hitting. Oh, my God. Fitment. Fitment is going to be like, honestly, I feel like fitment is going to be perfect. Like, it's going to tuck just enough. And then we may dibble and dabble into the lowering springs. But I don't know because of the 60 foot. So this angle right here is too hard, dog. Holy. Oh, my God. God, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta call, I gotta call one of the homies, I gotta call one of the homies, I gotta call one of the homies. Oh, we, damn, I'm looking hit right now, man, like the video right now, just for how a nigga looking on camera, like, whoo, but it's hot in here, I'm sweating, if you ain't like that video yet, I don't know what you're doing. Let me see, let me see. Let's see, let's see if he answers the phone. I doubt it. Y'all see, first hand, bro. Homies be capped out, bro. Homies be capped out, bro. Oh, I know who's gonna answer. 
the hell? I don't know why I ain't called bruh first. I don't know why I ain't called bruh first. Oh my God, this angle right here is so killer, y'all. This angle right here is so killer, bro. I can't wait till, till those are finished. When those are finished, So I guess nobody's about to answer the call. Bro, what the fuck? See someone that you know and they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine, but you just can't get into it because they would never understand. I hope, I hope that y'all see the vision, but I know y'all don't because this is just like one small ass part of it, but I hope y'all see the vision. I know one dude I do got a call, and we'll see if bro answer. I ain't gonna lie. Bro been showing me all kinds of sneak peeks on the ZL1. When he got the vet, before he got it, he told me about it. So I gotta show bro before I show the public. Yup. What's good, gang? You got the GoPro back? Hey, you already know what's going down. So look. I see what happened. You lost the SD card and all. I'm like, damn. Hell yeah. But you know, content creators, bro, we can't stay down for too long, gang. You feel me? So look, check me out, man. So I was telling the vlog, man, you know, me and you, we be chopping it up and shit. And y'all ass really like be giving me like the sneak peeks and shit before I go to the public. You feel me? So like that being said, you know what I'm saying? The kid had to go ahead, return the favor one time, you feel me? I'm out here, you know, test fit and shit. And I like, hold on, let me just, you know, let me call my boy real quick. And you actually the only one who answered too, no cap, which is crazy as fuck. You're gonna see it in the vlog. I call like four, five niggas, none of these niggas answered. So, you the only one, bruh. So yeah, look at this hoe. Get yeah, them the fronts. Oh, yeah, I think you did have the rears. Oh, you busted. Never once I got anything. Yes, sir, Ski. Yeah. Same ones. Why you think I kept asking you what tires you had on them bitches? And I was just finna say that, bro. It is crazy. I just went to the shop and I forgot to tell you, bro. Nah, you good. You good. I ain't doing no tweaking. That shit look crazy, bro. Good. So what, is, is you gonna paint them how you get your lyrics or what? Nah, so, damn, see, gang got to ask the questions. I got to cut the camera off, man. <laughs> All right, you guys, so there y'all have it. Vader's got a new set of four stars. We do have the Weld S71s for the rear still. We're going to be swapping up the whole setup. First and foremost, side note, excuse my garage, bro. I know it's a mess. I got a lot of cleaning up to do. I just got back in town, then we got hit with the hurricane. And so I'm still just getting in the swing of things, getting back into the motions, bro. So don't get on me in the comments about my garage. It's gonna get clean, bro, chill. Um, but yeah, so like I say, we still got the well S71s for the rear. The complete drag pack reveal is gonna go dummy, trust. So that being said, y'all, y'all just make sure y'all stay tuned to the channel. Hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, drop a comment in the comment section down below. Let me know if you guys are excited to see the four starts legitimately mounted up to Vader, not just mocked up to Vader. And what's in that box, if this video drops before that video, <laughs> bro, trust me, I ain't gonna lie. We're low key loaded. The best looking six gen one LE in the area. Low key, I ain't gonna lie, we low key building that right now. Cause like, I ain't gonna lie, I ain't. I don't know who messing with me, bro. So that being said, man, I'm gonna go ahead and close this video out here. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, turn on post notifications, drop a comment in the comment section down below. Hit this video a big thumbs up. As you see, my hands dirty as hell. I'm gonna go ahead and go in the crib. Take a shower, get cleaned up, get to working on this video. I'll see y'all in the next one.